Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Arbuckle. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make a guard tower in Minecraft. This is a pretty awesome guard tower. As you guys can see, there's a door there in the front that allows you to climb up to the top. If you want, you can spawn some villagers at the top to walk around and actually look like guards. But what you're going to need for this build is spruce wood, stone bricks, birch fences, birch wood slabs, stone brick stairs, birch wood stairs, redstone lamps, redstone torches, ladders, and one dark oak door. So without further ado, let's jump straight into this build. All right, guys, so the first thing we wanna do is we wanna pick our location where we're gonna start our guard tower. So if we're gonna start right here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna replace this dirt block with stone bricks, and I'm gonna place my dark oak door on top of those bricks. So this is gonna be the entrance to our guard tower, and we're kinda gonna build around this door. So this is where we're gonna start. The next thing that we wanna do is we wanna take our spruce wood and we wanna go three blocks high on each side. So we're gonna to go to the left and we're gonna go three blocks high. Then we're gonna go to the right, do the same thing, three blocks high. And then in between these two blocks where it's open here, we're gonna place some stone brick stairs so it looks just like this. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna get some birch fences and we're gonna put three birch fences on each side of the spruce wood. So we're gonna come over here, place one, two, three, just like that. And then we're gonna come over here, place one, two, three, just like that. And this is gonna be the front side to the bottom of our guard tower. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna make each side of this square bottom the exact same as the front here, except instead of having a door on every side, we're gonna replace this with two stone brick blocks. So I'll show you what I mean. We're gonna go over and we're gonna start with the right side. We're gonna do exactly what we did at the beginning, put down three spruce wood blocks like that. And then instead of the door, like I said, two stone bricks, we're gonna put our stone brick stairs on top of that. Go right back to our spruce wood, three high, and then finish off this side with three more birch fences, just like this. We do the exact same thing on the other two sides. So again, three spruce wood, two stone bricks, one stone brick stair, three more spruce wood, one, two, three, didn't mean to do that, three more birch fences, and then we're gonna do this last side over here. So three, two, the stairs, and then three spruce wood to finish it off. So going around, this is what it should look like. All these these back three, the right, the left, and the very back side should look identical, and the front should look very similar, except instead of stone bricks, we're actually gonna have the door to the entrance. So this is what that should look like so far. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna start working on the inside so that it's easier to work up, instead of working up and then go back down and work on the inside. So what we're gonna do is something very basic. We're gonna take out the dirt blocks in here and replace them with stone bricks. This really doesn't do anything, it just makes it look a little bit more cool instead of just having grass when you first walk in it actually has a stone bottom so it should look like this from the inside then what we're going to do is we're going to place three stone bricks on the back wall straight in the middle just like that essentially this is going to be where we place our ladder to climb up to the top but for now we're just going to put three down just like this all right guys now that we've done that we're going to go back to the outside and we're going to get birch wood slabs and we're going to go all the way around the outside of what we've built with birch wood slabs starting from the birch wood fences so we'll put one down in the corner here we're going to go all the way around on the outside we're not going to fill this in we're going to make this hollow so that again we can climb up to the top and when we're done with that it should look something just like this all right guys so now that the birch wood slabs are down what we're going to do is we're going to go place another stone brick on top of our original tower stone bricks here and then we're going to want to put spruce wood in each corner here so what we're going to do is we're going to put spruce wood in each of these corners and then in the open spots we're going to put more stone bricks so as you guys can see when you actually put down the spruce wood it goes sideways like that and the only way to prevent that is to put spruce wood underneath of it first and then put one on top so that it goes straight up and then we can get rid of the block that we place below it so we're going to do that in each corner remember start one down so that we can get the wood going straight up and then get rid of the wood that you placed at the bottom so we're going to do this on all four sides just like this four and then as you guys can see we have openings all the way around we're going to put stone brick just like this and again this is where we're going to place our ladder that allows us to climb to the top so from the inside looking up this is what it should look like so far the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to get our spruce wood back out and we're going to go two spruce wood blocks high in each corner where the spruce wood already is. So right here, obviously, there's more wood, so we're going to go two more blocks higher. I want to do this in each corner all the way around. So going back to the front, this is what that should look like. Then we're going to do the exact same thing with the stone bricks. So we're going to go two high on each side just like this. And as you guys can see, the second 
layer to our guard tower is looking pretty good. This is what that should look like from the front side. All right, guys. So now what we're going to do is we're going to get out our stone brick stairs and we want to place our stone brick stairs on the bottom stone. So this block right here all the way around, except we don't want it to look like this, like it does down here. We want it to be upside down. And the only way to do that is if we go straight down and look up to the block. So if we look up at the block and place it like that, you guys can see that it comes out like that. So we're going to do that on all four sides. Remember, we're not going to do it on the top block. We're going to do it on the, the middle block. So go back down. Place. Uh, see, I wasn't far down enough. We'll place one there. Come over here. Place one there. Again, I messed up. <laughs> and then we'll place one there, just like that. So if you aim at the top of the block, it should actually look like this. So we'll go back over here. And this is what that should look like so far. Then what we're going to do is we're going to get our spruce wood back out. We're going to put one spruce wood block on, e on top of each of the stairs that we just placed. So... Go to each stair and put down a spruce wood block, just like that. We have this cool little design here, as you guys can see. And then what we're going to do is we're going to get our birch fences, and we're going to connect these all the way around. So we're going to put a birch fence in the corners. So two there, two here, two on this side, and then our final side, we'll put two more. So this is what the second layer of our guard tower should look like so far. The next thing that we're going to do is we're going to get our stone bricks back out, and on each side, of uh, this cool design that we have. We're gonna put a stone brick on top of the wooden block. So there should only be four. We're not going all the way around, just on the very ends. So it should look like that. So we should have four. And then what we're gonna do on each of these wooden corners, we're gonna place another spruce wood block. So one, two, three, four. So it should finish our design there. And going back to the front, as you guys can see, this is what that should look like so far. Now what we're going to do is we're going to get our spruce wood blocks back out. And we're going to place spruce wood blocks on top of each of the birch fences that we just put down. So there should be eight all the way around. One, two, three, four, if I can get to it, five, six, seven, eight. And then we go back to the front here, wherever the front is. <laughs> and as you guys can see, this is what that should look like. Now this is where we're going to get out our redstone lamps. We're going to put down four redstone lamps on top of each of the stone bricks here. So we're going to put one, two, three, four, just like that. Then we're going to get out our birch fences and put birch fences on each side where the wooden blocks are. So we're going to put two on this side, two on this side, two on the back, two on the right. And then what we're going to do is we're going to connect all of these so that they actually make a square. So where these two are, we're going to connect them, and we're not going to put a block underneath them. We're just going to connect them. So we're going to connect the corners on each side, just like this. And then going back to the front, this is what that should look like so far. All right, so now, as you guys can see, we need to come up one more layer so that our platform is actually flat. So what we're going to do is we're going to fill this square all the way around with stone bricks. Remember, we're going to leave the bottom or the middle open so that we can climb up with our ladder. And we're going to get our ladders out. We'll go ahead and go to the bottom here and we'll place our ladders down so that we can actually get to the top when it's time to climb this thing. So ladders all the way to the top. Remember on the back side. And once you get to the top, it'll make it easier and you can actually walk around and see. All right, guys. So now that you have the ladders down, you want to get out your redstone torches. And we're going to put a redstone torch in front of each of these lamps so that they light up. So if all of them light up, you should be good to go. And we'll move on with the next step. All right, guys, now what we're going to do is we're going to get our birch fences back out. We're going to put down one birch fence on each side of these redstone lamps. So for example, we have one lamp here. So we're going to go one higher on each side. We're going to leave the corners open just like that with one. Do the same thing on this side. On this side. And then over here, we do the exact same thing. Remember, the corner should only be one fence, and the ones right next to the lamp should be two fences. So it should look just like this. So now what we're going to do on each of the fences that we just placed, we're going to put stone brick stairs on the top. So we're going to go all the way around with stone brick stairs facing out. So it should look just like this. Do it on the back and do it back here. And as you guys can see, we have stone brick stairs on top of each of the fences that we just placed. Now what we're going to do is we're going to fill in the holes with birch wood stairs. So as you guys can see, we're going to fill that there. And then we're going to fill the corners so that we have this cool little off and on design with the birch wood and the stone stairs. So when that is said and done, it should look something just like this. As you guys can see, I missed one. Hold on. 
There we go. So now it should look just like this. Now we're going to do essentially the same exact thing on the next layer. So what I'm going to do to actually get to the next layer is I'm going to place a block behind this. And this is just going to be a base block so that I can get up to the next layer. So I'm going to put a base block down and I'm going to match this one. So I'm going to put another stone or another birch stair just like that on top of this birch stair. And I'm going to get rid of that placement block. So once we have that down, we can go all the way around the outside with the same exact design. It's just going to be a lot smaller. So we're going to do the same thing. Put stone brick stairs on each side. And then instead of going out one more because it's smaller, we're going to come back over here. Put down our birch stairs like this. Stone stair. And remember, we're just rotating off and on. And it should match. Stone stair. And then last but not least, the birch stair. So as you guys can see, the roof should start to come together and look just like this. All right, guys, the last step is to put one birch wood slab on the very top. So again, I'm going to place a placement block down just like that. Place my birch wood slab down just like that. And then I'm going to go inside, climb up to the top. And as you guys can see, this is what it should look like. If you want to get rid of that placement block, you can. It really doesn't matter that much. It's not going to make a difference. Um, but as you guys can see, this is what it looks like from up here. You can kind of look on each corner. Um, you've got a pretty good view. I'll go back downstairs. This is what it looks like down here when you walk in. You can close the door. And voila, that is our guard tower. This is how to build a guard tower in Minecraft. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments down below. Make sure to check out my vlog channel. I'll leave a link to that in the description down below. I've been uploading a lot of cool videos over there. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next video. Can we be friends?